Hi guys, so I'm going to finally do a video of my Halloween decorations. Today is Halloween, so I'm kind of late with showing you guys. Shut up, dog! But, um, my daughter's having a Halloween party here today, so I cleaned my house so I could show you guys. So we'll start with, we got a danger, there's my guineas out there yelling, a danger zombie zone. And we have some skeletons in there, but it's kind of hard to see them because they've kind of flipped around. Here's our little fall flag and we got lights going up around the arch we got this sign it's really cute it's dead end cemetery there's my witch's outfit on my girl and then up here got it all decorated cute we got some straw bales my guys are falling over i think i showed you guys this already but um my two moms died i don't know what happened that fish tank has to get put out in the shed i just drained it and we got like this cute pumpkin it's cute. And then we got around this with the leaves. And then both of the doors with the hocus pocus in the fall. Here's Mr. Skeleton. Skeleton guy. Oh, and then we got two rugs. We got this one. And then we got one inside the door trying to take the leaves in the house. Alright, so this is the front room where the animals are. Little flower thing. We got our stick tree all decorated light up kitty and then this table i just cleaned off to make it for the snacks and stuff this cute guy i got him at uh one of the conventions a guy takes uh care bears and makes them all creepy these guys got some halloween stuff on them oh my kitty fell i opened a window because it's nice today it's in the 50s up here in ohio too today I'm scared kitty and then all my animals are their stuff's all done for fall i wasn't able to find any halloween fleece so i just been doing fall i was gonna do green and um like green and black but i didn't find any black either i might order some online got her cage all clean there's the dragon bearded dragon and here's the back door and all my plants some pumpkins and scarecrow here's my witch i love this witch had her for a few years i got her at a rustic store that was my husband's he loves like the old-fashioned halloween stuff we got some stuff here we got these tins because i used to sell home interiors so we got Quite a few of them. There's him, Scarecrow over here is the um, turkey. Of course, Sugar Glider's sleeping. My dog keeps whining. I don't know what her problem is. We got this one. Frankenstein. It's monster. And we got the bear. They're really cute. There's my frog. Checks it out for once. So, um, that's this room. I think that's all the Halloween stuff we have in here. Oh, except for, here's my husband's, his Stay puff marshmallow man that he found he he was so excited when he found him so now here's the kitchen we don't have as much halloween stuff in here let's try and do a day of the dead theme in here we have just have like some glasses there's a pumpkin and then i got some um dog go somewhere quit whining she's gonna really be whining here soon because i'm giving her a bath and then we did the uh day of the dead towels and there's some more over here we did find i did find this little guy at the dollar tree there's another cup and here's my turkey and that and then this is really cute if you could see it past my cat's big butt move out of the way sis for one minute this is really cute sis trick or treat and trash needs change don't look at that <laughs> and i got some day of the dead stickies for on the fridge they're the t like the real sticky ones so i can reuse them next year and then we just put i put a little guy there a little thing oh we do have magnets that i found these are really cute Got them a couple years ago halloween magnets and then just a pumpkin over here you can put candles in here's the dining room this is my, some of my fall stuff i haven't put out yet because i'm going to change the wreath up on the fireplace so here's the table it's really cute it has the day of the dead and then then i'll be switching it to the fall i'll be taking this off but i'll do a fall video too and then these guys i just got and i think one of them might have fell so there should be another one of these guys hold on a second let me back here guys real quick because I don't want it to get ruined. I just got them this year. Ugh. Oh, yep, there he is. One second. Oh, I can't put a cat up here. He's probably covered in dog hair now. Oh, there we go. <laughs> this little guy, the kids must have knocked him back. But I just got them off eBay. They're so cute. And I got the kitty cat. I got them last year, but I didn't get to put them out because it was after the holiday. And then we got this one. And we have this really cute Thanksgiving table runner. I need it. My mom can't sew anymore, so I'm going to have to find... I'd like to find a Halloween table runner. 
And then we got some candles. Really good ones. We got pumpkin spice. And then this one is farm, fall farmhouse. They both smell really good. I think I got them at Walmart. So that's the table. Looks really cute and festive. Here's my hutch. My one hutch. I have my husband's dishes out that he collected for years. And I put them back out. He liked these little guys. He would buy them at the Dollar Tree all the time. And I had three of these and I was so mad. Two of them got broke. And they were my husband's. He loved Jack Skellington. The Nightboard Before Christmas was one of his favorite movies. And so I tried to order another set on eBay. And there's the, this guy. They were they had one set and they sold. They wanted like forty five dollars. I was like, ah, oh, yeah, I'm not come doing that. I got this stuff. And then someone sent me a really nice Halloween card. So and then this is cute. I got these little witches boots. And then I also got a um, pair of, I had uh, elf ones last year and we, I had a mouse of all the things the mouse got in the basement and got into it and destroyed it. So, and I put my day of the dead guys out, I got him, Oogie Boogie, one of the lock, stock and barrels, I got this guy, I just put him in here and then there's lock, stock and barrel at the top. I'm sorry about my dog. I don't know what's wrong with her. She just wants to keep whining and whining every day. She's driving me insane, actually. And this is centerpiece from actually from my first marriage whenever we had our Wedding, we got married on Halloween, so that was our wedding centerpiece. It's just cute. My mom had kept it all these years and gave it to me. And I got this little guy, uh, Scarecrow. Here's a goofy turkey I got years ago. And this this one's really cute, too. And then we got up here all decorated on top of the TV. I got this this year. There's a lady in town at one of those little antique stores that makes uh, paints, gourds and stuff. And I thought it was really cute. And then I bought this guy this year, too, this little pumpkin kid. He's so funny. And I got this guy this year, too. Some lady was making, had made them. She made that, and then she made this one. Just so cute. And she even named them. This one's, uh, what's this one? Oh, Katie Creations. This is Sully the Scully, and this one is Agnes. <laughs> and then here's my babies. They got dressed for Halloween. The ones that I did dress. I didn't dress all the ones. I got these last year too, really cute. Someone made them with cloth. There's all my unicorns. And here's the babies in here. And they're Halloween jammies. And they're all sitting in my pram, my old pram. And we got on the man in front of the mantle, we got the scarecrow guys. We got a little skeleton dog. Those aren't, aren't Halloween, but then we got another little Halloween guy. And then here's my mantle all decorated up. This is in front of the fireplace. It's cute. My husband found this witch the last couple years ago. I thought she was really cute. And then there's my Halloween witch. Uh, what do you call it? Wreath. That's the word I was looking for. And then these my unicorns. Oh, and he also found these cute things. They hang up. Oh, I may have to turn the light on so you guys can see it. Oh, I think my light's unplugged. One second. There we go. There. See the little witch, like, ch wind chime? And then over here is this one. It is, or not a witch, that one's a kitty, and this one's the witch. <laughs> really funny. And then I got my pillows. Got Jack Skellington pillows. And then my fall pumpkin pillow. Another Jack Skellington pillow. So, and then, well, we got some pumpkins down here, too, along front of the TV. And let's go into the bathroom. I don't have my rugs down right now because they're in the wash, but um, we did mostly like leaves, leaf theme, leaf theme in here. Some pumpkins. And I got this really pretty um, I can't think today, guys. Shower curtain, that's the word. And I found these cute towels at Walmart. They were really cute. So I got those. Oh, we have this. My husband got that a couple years ago. Soap, this little soap thing. So, and then my bedroom is the last room. It's decorated too, actually. We got a little witch's hat with a dragon. And we got some Halloween stuff on the back of the head headboard. I'll go to the other side. Here's my bed. 
got a Jack Skellington and we got a black cat on there. And then here's the other half of my headboard. There's an artist that goes to the conventions that makes these scratch um, boards. They're really cute. And there's a lady on Etsy that makes these. You can find her on um, Spooky Design something. I can't think of the last part. She's on Facebook too. There's my my altar. I got her from last year too. Dragon Unicorn. So cute. There's all my unicorn stuff. I don't know if I showed you guys lately. And my Buddha stuff. And then here's these guys. I never got them dressed for how dressed. I had an outfit right here and I haven't put it on her for Halloween. But my silicones, I didn't change them. I left them. And then there's this side. So we didn't do, I didn't do a lot of Halloween in here, just a few things, but I still think it looks cute. All right, let's go out front and I'll show you the decorations and then we'll be done. I might take some pictures of all my decorations. Let's see here. Whew, it's cold on the feet. I didn't put my shoes on. It's a gorgeous day though. So here's my leaves. I don't have a lot of, I only have one tree in my front yard, so there's not a lot of leaves. So we got, we got some lights all the way up, but they don't work anymore, but I still put them in. And then we got some inflatables. My turkey's kind of falling over. This one's my favorite, my unicorn, skeleton unicorn that I found for Halloween. So cute. And then we got up here decorated a little bit. The flag's all tangled up. Got some scarecrows, and we got, I got tired of buying pumpkins all the time. They just died. Well, that board grew in my garden, but so I just put some fake ones out here and stuff my plants dying I think I should take this in the house so but that's it for now guys I just wanted to oh let me show you this creepy guy I have right here I forgot about him he's kind of creepy and there's some lights along there I'm wrapped around the bushes around the things so oh shoot this light bulb in I'm gonna plug this colorful light bulb in the house for the night it turns like orange and green and purple I think so, anyways, I just want to show you guys my Halloween decorations before I turned it to fall. I wanted to do a video, and I just didn't get around to it till now. So, um, I might try to do a video tonight at the party of everybody's costumes, so we'll see. But I will talk to you guys later. Have a good Halloween. Bye.